So I got this van that you can actually live in, but it also has a really cool feature. On the inside, we've got a refrigerator and a bed down there. Then we have this seating area with a TV, but let's just say that you want a little bit more room. We can actually open out the back and it makes it way more spacious in here. Look, this is the bedroom closed versus open. So what I was thinking we can do is we can let some people get in the back and then trap them. Oh yeah, this is what it looks like from the outside when you open and close it. So yeah, this is going to be fun. So I pulled up to Grove. It seems like we've got a couple of people here right now. Yo, what's happening down here, man? Uh, I'm doing a recruitment booth currently. Why is this man covered in blood? Oh my god, <laughs> what just happened? Okay, Grove has got a little bit crazy since five minutes ago. Everybody, and I mean everybody, is shooting. Hey bro, do you want to try something out real quick? What's up? You know my van over here, you can hop in the back. I've got like a bedroom, a uh, kitchen, everything. I think I'm all right. I don't, I don't generally get in strangers' vans. <laughs> Why, man? It's like a camper van. I've, I've just heard bad things, you know, people, you know, getting too much free stuff from backs of vans, you know? Um, I just called a buddy. He said he'd like to check out the back of your van. Okay, so I'm going to get the back of the van ready. I'm going to probably turn it around this way. Okay, here we go. Rear right door. Let's open that bad boy up. And then also we're going to need to open up the rooms. Okay, so now when his friend comes here, he's going to go inside and he's going to think it's normal. But little does he know, I'm going to squeeze him and trap him in there. Yeah, so you can actually walk in here when it's all opened out. But when it's closed, it's barely got any room. So I'm kind of happy it has this feature anyway. Because without this, it'd probably be unusable back here. Oh, you're getting in now? Yeah, I was I was enticed by the uh, by the visuals, man. Check out the yeah, check out the bed. Yeah, the, the bed is nice. Okay, here we go. Shut the rear right door. Close them in. <laughs> is it a little bit cramped in there, my man? How's it how's it going? Oh, oh it's it's a bit cramped. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, what is that in your passenger seat? Uh it's none of your concern what's in my passenger seat. What do you mean it's none of my concern? Is is that an no. anime yeah, pillow? Tell them what's Maybe. in your passenger seat. This man has an anime pillow in his passenger seat just chilling there. Right, so I've parked my van on top of a mansion. I think this was a pretty safe place to park it. No one should find it up here. But yeah, I think this mansion is owned by the mafia. Look, you can see someone below me inside the house right now. So I probably shouldn't be on their roof with a pistol out. Let me start by putting the pistol away. Damn, they got Lambos parked up here. Wait, Vladimir Chesnokov. That seems like a very frightening name. Wait, how can I get in? Can I go in here? Yep. Hey, Vladimir. Hello, my friend. Whoa, 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 whoa. The hell? Let me run down inside the basement. Okay, I'm not trying to get shot, but there seems to be a lot of people in here. Wait a minute. These guys have got like a golden cart carrying their alcohol. That's how you know when someone is rich. Chicken curry, $5. You want? A chicken curry for $5. Yes. Chicken curry, $5. Is it a chicken curry or curry? Curry! Oh my god. Okay. I don't know, man. I probably shouldn't be trusting a random man offering me curry. Hey, bro, look. How about this? You can eat your curry in the back of my van. Let me open up the door for you. There you go. All right. And there's like a table area you can sit down at if you want. Let me shut the door. <laughs> All right, bro. Take a seat or you can eat on my bed if you want. Whichever one works for you. <laughs> what do you do to me? I'm squishied. This man's curry is probably going everywhere right now. How much can I buy it? I want to buy. Oh, no, it's not for sale. Oh, okay. Can I drive with you then? Can I sit in passenger? Uh, I don't know. You seem a little bit weird. You're offering me curry. I'll let you in the back. You should probably run now. Very good, Kali. Want to try? No, I don't want to try your very nice curry. Spoon feed here. I don't want to be spoon fed. Do not even try it. Hey, how about you go and climb that crane there? I climb crane? Okay, I climb crane. That's one way you get rid of a crazy man. Go on, bro. I want to see you skydive. This poor man is about to break every single bone in his body. Oh, there he goes. Come on. Oh, you hit the van. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I just found out that you could break the expanding bits off. So look, this side is now broken and we have a massive gaping hole. And then if I back up here onto the palm tree, there we go. Now our home is completely exposed. Wait, can I jump up through here? I can. My TV is on show. My bed, oh, my bed doesn't even exist anymore. Wait, did that get ripped off here? <laughs> 
<laughs> oh man. Okay, well, if anyone needs a bed, you can grab this one here for free. Hey bro, are you interested in hopping in the back of my van? Yes. All right, so basically to your behind you, you got like the seating area, then you got the bedroom. If you just sit down at like the seating area, you can eat some stuff there if you want. Bro, go in the bedroom real quick. I need you to grab something for me. Yeah, there you go. Okay. <laughs> oh, what the heck? I'm getting squished. You good back there? Oh, my game's being so bad. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna let you grab a cola from the fridge. Ooh, there's a TV with the bag man with a shotgun. Yeah, bro. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'm stuck, dude. What the Yo, one of you guys broke my the side here. Wait, what the hell? This side is broke too? Okay, so some further damage has been done, but that's fine. All right, bro. You should try and stuff that in the back now. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> oh my. Why fire. are we going super oh fast? What the hell just happened? Oh. Um... Okay, I have no idea what just happened there. Somehow him putting that lawnmower in the back made it go super fast. Uh, I installed a turbo while you weren't looking. All right, dude, get your lawnmower and stuff it in the back again. We'll see what we okay. can do. All right, bro, here we go. Oh my God. <laughs> Who won? Oh boy, the turbo has engaged. <laughs> <laughs> so I just saw someone advertise their mechanic store in the chat. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the back like this. And then real quick, I'm going to break the sides off like we done before. Then we're pretty much going to go in there and tell them that we need it fixed. Yo, look at this interior though. They got a coffee machine over here. I did think these were vending machines, but they're just like oil and stuff for cars. Right, I'm really hoping that this guy doesn't work here since he's got blood all over his suit. Maybe he does and he just doesn't care. But yeah, they seem pretty packed in here. I don't even know who the owner is. Okay, sir, are you the owner of this place? Uh, I am not, mate. Do you work there at least? Uh, no, mate. I'm a lawyer. Then what have you got the earpiece for and that little badge? Because I'm a lawyer. You don't I'm look lawyer, like but... a lawyer. You look like you work in there, bro. Fly yeah, I was wheels. hoping you could fix my uh, my RV. Um, I can help you in criminal law. Right, okay. Well, can you at least be a mechanic for like two minutes? My bed oh my fell God. out. I got like a TV back here. This is amazing. Well, it was amazing until it got destroyed by me. <laughs> so do you think you can fix it? They're too pretty big holes. Uh, where are they? What do you mean, where are they? You're walking through them. Um, I can't help you with that. Sorry, mate. Oh, well, thank you for wasting my time. Excuse me. I'm a very busy man. What do you mean? You're walking around doing nothing. Is this your car? This is indeed my car. You got the cheap one, I see. Cheap one? How much is this? More than you can afford, pal. All right, listen. Come here. If you want to tussle, we can tussle. Come on, then, fist fight. Come on, then. <laughs> Oh, was that a Mike Tyson blow to the head? Okay, but for real now, I'm actually trying to get my RV repaired or at least see if they can repair it. So let me pull in the back entrance. I'm kind of already in their store. Then we're going to hop out, lock the door. Not that it really matters anyway. You can climb through the back. Hello, I need some assistance, please. Hey, are you the mechanic guy? Yeah, I am. I need you to help me, bro. I will after I get this one fixed up, okay? Yo, look at these Lambo wraps, though. Imagine he could wrap my RV with this wrap right here. Okay, why has this person... Oh my god. I was about to say, why has this person put that massive thing on top of the Lambo? A Lambo is not the car to be putting that on top of. I'm sorry. Okay, this is the second Lambo you've been customizing, sir. My, uh, my RV's getting a little bit cold out there. Oh, no. Look at the front of this Lambo. That just uh, ruins hey. everything. Get fixed, man. Just give me a minute, all right? I got you. Don't worry, fat boy. <laughs> I called him a fat boy. Hey, bro, you want to see something cool? Yeah, sure. All right, come round. So, you ever seen an RV before? What's an RV? Go take a look at the TV. We've got a bedroom in there. Everything. Yeah, man, it's cool, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's, yeah. Stand on the bed. Come on. There we go. Close him in oh, there. Squash him tight. up a little bit. Yeah, it's meant to be. That's the whole point. You like it? Shall I stop or not? I don't know. It's kind of messing with my legs. I don't think you're going to have any legs in a minute. There we go. I'll stop. All right. You made it through. Feel yeah. free to come back outside, sir. Look at this man. He's been abused. <laughs> you kind of felt good. Kind of. Go on. Get back to your car before I shove you in the back again. Oh. Okay, we should probably get out of here now. Let me just get back inside of my RV. Okay, I was never here. Wait, I kind of want to see if he's still laying there or not. I'm going to squeeze through here. The sides are probably going to break off. Yep. Oh, you're still here? Okay, you need to wake up now. I'm not going to jail. My arms are broken. You look like a snail. I am a snail. My name's Gary the Snail. 
Meow. Hey, bro, have you ever seen an RV like this? I've got a TV in the back. Hey, what, are you trying to let me go in or what? Yeah, you can jump in. It's a bit broken right now, though. Okay, so I got the RV fixed, and now I'm about to show this guy what it's meant to look like. Okay, little does he know I'm about to lock him in here. Okay, let me close the door. Here we go. Oh, Come on, my dog. Oh, <laughs> I can't get out, bro. Wait, why is it moving, dude? All right, I'm going to open the door. You can come out. Look, this is what it looks like from outside. Come take a look. I like this, man. Here, you want to make a deal? I'm a businessman, all right? Listen, listen. You take this thing right here, all right? You take this thing, and I take this thing right here. To be honest, that's a pretty good deal. I'll take the, the Ferrari. Okay, we just traded this beautiful-looking Ferrari for an ugly-looking RV. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Okay, well, this Ferrari lasted about five seconds.